stuff. This doesn't mean. I mean, if you look at this, look at see this. How many? This how small this move is. If I put the index for the dollar. Look how big this, how dollar has sold off. This is how the selling that came into the dollar, and this is all the selling that came in the Swiss. Practically nothing, and that tells us that the dollar is kind of strong versus the Swiss. And I should be looking at buying the dollar versus the Swiss with this. You can see that with all the selling that came on on Friday, even though this is a weak close, I'll be looking for a continuation, but I'll take the continuation when it trades below the low, which i.e. below 89 handle, and I can buy it easily and get above the high, which is 89.17. So I have a very easy trade on the pound and the dollar Swiss. You're going to go short. This is how easy it is. You're going to go short below 89, and you're going to go long above 89, right there, 27. That is, I mean, this is going to be your buy signal. So 89, 27 is going to be your buy signal. Your selling signal is below the 89, and if you buy it above 87 you're going to place your stop below the 89 and if you go short below the 87 you're going to place your stop again above the 89.27 and you have the structure long as 93 it remains the same and on the short side we have to pick up the structure short just using this as a significant point it's not a structure it already broke it that's interesting so the next one the show next short structure is 8562. Okay, so the we're still looking at buying the dollar Swiss, believe it or not, because now you see this it's breaking and now it is kind of holding and it's trying to make any trade above this would be a structural failure to the upside and that would be our buying point above the low. Uh, so with that, the we're going to buy above 89.27 and the structure long is 93 so I got like 500 pips to the upside and our stop is going to be about 27 pips at 89 on the short side we're going to go short below 89 and I'm going to use my long entry to the upside as my stop which is 89.27 and my structure short is 85.62 so I have about 500 pips to the downside on that okay that is the